Welcome into the video. I am your tech guy, Wayne, and today I want to show you how to send large files, specifically long videos, from your Samsung A15 to uh, someone else via text message or via email. Uh, what you're going to want to do is go to your gallery, so swipe up and go to your gallery app. And from there, I have a video that I just took. This video is 1 minute 11 seconds, which you normally would not be able to send this over um, text message because it's just too, too large of a file. And same thing over email. It, it does not meet the uh, size requirement. So you're going to hit the share button in the bottom corner, this button here. And then from there, you want to tap on quick share and then you're going to tap on QR code or link. And what it's going to do is it's going to upload your video to the cloud temporarily so that you can basically make it accessible to anyone who has this link down here. You're going to simply tap copy URL. And then um, you can choose whatever method works for you in terms of sending that link. So you can send it to someone over a text message. Uh, right here, I'm in my text messaging app. I can just simply tap on this text message here. Now, once you tap on text message, you'll see the link that you just copied. It'll show up right underneath. You can simply tap it to add it into the message. Now, if you don't see that link there, no problem. You can tap on this icon here. This is the clipboard icon and tapping that will show you everything that you've recently copied on the phone. And I can simply just tap on this. This is my most recent uh, copy right here. It'll play right into the text message box. I'm gonna hit that button to send it off. And now all you have to do is wait a couple of minutes because it will take a few minutes for that uh, video to upload to the cloud. And then the person you sent it to will be able to just click on the link just like this. And they'll be able to access that video and they can download it either to their phone or they can um, copy that link as well and send it to their computer and then download it there. But either way, this is the fastest and easiest way to send a large file. Now, the same thing will work for email. You simply will just go to your Gmail app and you'll just create a new message. Tap on the compose button in the bottom right corner. And you're going to tap where it says compose an email and tap on that little clipboard icon and then tap on the link and then enter who you want to send the link to and hit send. And that's it. Now your large video file uh, will be accessible to anyone with that link. And this is just a great option for those of you that have taken a really nice family video or recital video, anything like that. And you want to get that that link out so people can see it but obviously the file is too large to send via text. One more thing I wanna point out. So I just showed you how to send one large video file. This will also work if you're trying to send a lot of pictures at one time because the same thing holds true. You can't send too many pictures via text at one time. But if I go to my gallery and let's say I wanna send all these files at one time, I'm gonna hold down on that first file and then it'll give me this all button at the top here that I can use to select all the pictures and videos, or I can hold down the first one. And then after one second, it'll give me little bubbles and I can start selecting more files that I want to be included. Let's say I want to send all these pictures and I want to send that large video as well. So now I have pictures and videos. This is definitely too much to text or too much to send over an email. So I'm going to follow that same process. I'm going to hit the share button. I'm going to tap on quick share. And I'm just going to click on QR code or link. And once you've clicked on that and copied it, you can then paste it into your text message or your email to send it out to anyone that you want to have access to those videos and those pictures. So hope you guys found this helpful. If it was, make sure you hit that like button down below. Now you'll find two other really helpful videos right here and right here. So make sure you check out one of those next so you can keep learning how to use your A15. Thanks again for watching. Take care and as always, have a good one.